Hi guys, welcome to AUD Free Channel. If you're an Audible user, you know how frustrating it can be when your audiobooks won't sync across your devices. Don't worry, today, we're going to walk through some quick and easy fixes to get you back to listening without any interruptions. Let's dive right in. Fix 1. Enable Whisper Sync for Voice. Alright, first up, let's talk about Whisper Sync for Voice. This feature allows you to switch between listening to your Audible audiobook and reading its Kindle ebook without losing your spot. If Audible isn't syncing, it's possible WhisperSync isn't activated. To enable WhisperSync, log into your Amazon account, then go to Manage Your Content and Devices. Next, click on the Preferences tab and make sure device synchronization is turned on. Remember, this will only work if both your Audible audiobook and Kindle ebook are WhisperSync compatible, so make sure you've got that covered. Fix 2. Turn on sync settings on Audible app. Now, if WhisperSync is enabled and you're still having issues, let's head to the Audible app. We can turn on the sync settings manually. Open the Audible app, tap on your profile, then go into settings. From there, tap player and toggle on sync device position or sync playback position. That should get everything synced up across your devices. Fix 3. Adjust sync settings on iTunes from computer. If you're using an iPhone and still having trouble, you can manually sync your Audible books using iTunes. First, connect your iPhone to your computer with a USB cable. Open iTunes, click on the device icon, and check manually manage music and videos. Then uncheck sync only check songs and videos and hit apply. Now go to the books section, select audiobooks, and drag the audiobook files over to your device. Once that's done, click eject and you're good to go. Fix 4. Refresh your Audible library. If syncing still isn't working, the next fix is a simple library refresh on your Audible app. Go to your profile, tap the menu button, then select help and support. Tap the three dots icon and choose full library refresh. This will update your account status and refresh your Audible library. Fix 5. Ensure your device and account are properly linked. Another common issue is devices not being properly linked to your Audible account. If your device isn't signed in correctly, syncing can fail. To check, open the settings on your Audible, Alexa, Kindle, or other related app on your devices and verify that your account email is correct. If it's not, just log out and log back in with the right email. Fix 6. Enable Audible syncing setting on your Apple Watch. Now, if you're trying to sync Audible to your Apple Watch, let's make sure everything's set up right. First, update the Audible app on your iPhone. Then, connect your Apple Watch to your iPhone via Bluetooth. Next, open Audible on your iPhone, tap the three dots next to the audiobook, and select Sync to Apple Watch. Make sure you have enough storage on your Apple Watch, and if the file is too large, try splitting the audiobook into smaller parts. Fix 7. Sync Audible books across all devices by a third-party tool. If all else fails, sometimes syncing issues are on Audible Send. In this case, you can use a third-party tool like AUD Free Auditor to remove DRM protection and transfer Audible files into MP3 or other formats. This program will keep lossless audio quality and preserve ID3 tags for each title, so you don't need to worry about the quality and management issue. Once transferred, you can upload your audiobooks to platforms like Apple Music or Google Drive and sync them across all your devices. Here are all fixes to the Audible not syncing issue. If auto playback still fails syncing across your devices, you'd better save books via AUD Free Auditor and play on other players. If this video was helpful, be sure to like and subscribe for more quick fixes and tech tips. Thanks for watching.